On the hillside of Mondrique Mountain, the neighborhoods of the Sans Mondrique district spread out. Its seat is indeed one of the most important places. It is a sedentary building between the modernism and nauscentism styles. A work by Jaume Gusta and Ubal Iranzo in which the nauscentism stained glass windows by Francesc Labarta especially stand out. Sans is the oldest neighborhood, however, it barely keeps the Casa de Reloja country house from its rural past. The building is currently a part of the Cocharas del Sans Community Center, one of the most important spots of the social life of the district. Another representative place of the Sans Mondrique neighborhood movement is Can Baggio. This is an old manufacturing building with a space turned into a social center. Besides Can Baggio, the traces of the old factories of the district have also been preserved. The Tres Chimenez, or the España Industrial Parks, are some examples of this. But the greatest lifeblood of the district is the Mondrique Mountain. This place suffered one of the most important transformations during the 1929 World's Fair when the Palau Nacional, the Casa de la Premsa, or the Font Magica were built. The neighborhoods of the Sans Mondrique also bear the witness of the recent history of our country. A clear example of it is the Shelter 307 built during the Civil War in Nau de la Rambla Street in the Pablo Sec neighborhood. However, what really defines the nature of these neighborhoods is the activity in the squares and streets which have little spots but also large avenues, theaters, markets, and some of the most dynamic commercial areas of the city. They liven up the street life and encourage neighbors and visitors to walk along our neighborhoods.